Hello YouTube, and welcome to a very late, like, recording. It's currently 4.20 in the morning. I am tired, but I looked at the eShop, and Car Mechanic Simulator was there. Which, I'm confused, because I thought this was going to be coming to the Xbox and PlayStation first, yet here we are. So... Uh, this is going to be a bit of a short video. If you want to see more of it, I will definitely live stream more of it when I'm not completely tired. So if I sound tired and I'm a bit quieter, that would be why. So anyways, hi. It's good to see you. I've just got our new baby, but it won't start. Isn't it beautiful? But we should see what is under the hood. What a weird conversation to have. Alright. Change to the engine part view. Uh, okay. So this doesn't look like it's a full-fledged car mechanic simula simulator like it is on the uh, PC and what it's going to be on the console. It seems more like a, almost like a mobile version of the game. We need to find out which parts are broken. Alright, uh, why? The parts which need to be replaced are highlighted. Alright, by the way, this is $15. So hopefully it's worth the money. Press B to toggle the bottom menu. Use arrows to select a part. Okay. Hold A to remove the broken part. Thanks, man. Good job. Now we only need to or need a new battery. I'm sure Joanne will be able to help us. Follow me. I'll turn the computer. I'll turn on the computer. Man, I can't read at 4 o'clock in the morning, apparently. So we can call her. Alright. Let's go to the parts market. Good morning. Welcome to the biggest parts market online. A new battery, no problem. Alright. This is so weird. Like, this came out of nowhere. I didn't even see any announcement for it either. Great! The delivery has arrived. Uh, X. Use arrows to select part. Alright. <laughs> Simple enough. Wow, really solid work. I called Larry. He's one of the best car dealers in town. He will show you how to sell this car. Hi, I'm Larry. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm just going to skip all that crap. Who cares? Uh, sell the car. $31,000 for that? All right, Larry. Congratulations. The money is already in your account. You have the balance information in the upper corner of the screen. It's time to get a new car. Come with me. I want to meet you. Meet my friend Bill. Well, okay. Hi, guys. Okay, I'm going to skip it. I don't care. Choose a barn. Sure, buy a barn. The car you bought is waiting in the garage. It's too time to start the repair. All right. Some uh, weird grammatical errors there. Rotate the right stick to remove the rust and apply putty. Now you can paint the car to increase its value. Well, it's just like really throwing you in there. Wow, that's kind of weird. All right. Don't think it's time to upgrade the tools? Okay, sure. If you say so. Tools upgrade allow you to replace more parts in your car. Radiator, brake, servo. Yeah, okay, fine. This almost seems like it was a free-to-play game, but then they took out the free-to-play aspects of it and then made it paid. Get ready. It's time to repair more cars and earn a lot of money. Oh, goody. So are we done now? Perfect. So what am I doing here? Oh boy, now I need to figure all this out. Oops, no, we'll go back. Uh. So is there like a show parts? Okay, so I guess it just shows you immediately which ones are not good. So yeah, I guess it's it's a lot more simplified. My goodness, so it just basically shows you right off the bat which ones you need to fix. And then that's that. So I'm wondering if the store is going to be as simple as that as well. I guess we'll find out. Uh, I guess we need a new air filter. A new air filter base. Oh, wait, which one? I guess I'll just go with that one. 
very, very odd. Um, okay, let's, oh no, get rid of that. Hit X. Get that in there. Get the 100% one. Oh man. See, I'm already doing a lot better than I did in the original car mechanic simulator. Could it be because the game is a lot easier? Absolutely not. It's just because I'm so good. So I guess the only thing about the change was the base, but that's okay. And then we need to get a break servo. I'll try not to misspell or mispronounce anything because a lot of people were very upset with me in the original video I did, which is almost at 140,000 likes, which is nuts. So I'll try to get all that under control. <laughs> Repair complete. Good job. Okay. And then the map. Wait, how did we sell the car? I don't even know how we did it. Uh, how do I get out of this menu? Trophies warehouse? No. Options? This is so, like, it almost doesn't feel like Car Mechanic Simulator. It really doesn't. Um... To fix these cars, I pray your tools. Okay. I don't want to... How do I sell the car? Oh, here we go. Great. Task list. Oh, there it is. 26,000. We get a lot more money in this, too. My goodness. All right. Um... Do I go here for a... No, I don't want to do that. Warehouse? No. Parts market? No. Tools. Let's go with tools level 3. I can't buy it, I guess. We have to repair 10 cars first. Okay. Oh, so this is the... Oh, no, those are achievements. Does that say cards collection? Is that supposed to say cars collection? Or is that just like... I'm so lost right now. Uh, so how do you get a new car? A? No. Plus? Minus? I guess we'll buy a barn? I don't know. Hey, we have a car now. So... <laughs> Holy crap. What is this? Alright, uh, plus. For the engine. Disassembly. I just don't understand why it shows you what you need to... Like, it just shows every part that needs to be replaced. And that's it. The menus are not that great either. Um... Being honest with you. Uh, this doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, there we go. I think I was pushing the wrong... No? Okay, for the love of God. Just give me the... Oh, there we go. Just spam all the buttons. It'll get it going. So we need a brake servo. Simple enough. A fuel filter. A battery. An exhaust manifold. That. And that. And that. And this. Are those all the parts that we need to take apart? Yay. <laughs> uh, okay, so we need a battery. We need... That thing... We need an exhaust manifold cover. Uh, we need a muffler of some sort. I mean, we have so much money. We might as well just buy one of each, right? I just don't know why we're making so much money in this. Uh, we'll just put those parts that we got. Why not? Oh, stupid X. There we go. Uh, a 
assembly. Get that on there. I mean, you don't even put the screws in or anything, so it's just kind of like, what is this? It's kind of upsetting, honestly. Alright, I don't have any of those. B1I4. Gotcha. Uh, so let's see where this is at. Where is it? Here, let's just do the fill. What did I just do? Wait, what was that? Current car. Uh, that didn't seem to change anything, but uh, cool, I guess. Uh, Alright, kind of understanding the menus. I still don't really like the controls over it, but... I guess it's something I get used to over time. And then, did I get the... I thought I think I got this already, didn't I? I did. Alright. Perfect, so I think that's all the parts we need, and we'll be good to go, and that'll be another car completed. If I'm not mistaken. Although it looks like the brakes could be using some work as well. Let's see if that's part of the task list. Yes, the brake discs. Brake discs, and apparently we need an air filter still? I didn't realize that was a predicament. Oh yeah. Looks like it still would filter out some air, I guess. I mean, come on now. And then it's just people being picky. Alright, so that should complete that. Now we'll go to the body and fix body. Wow. We're taking care of this rust, everybody. <laughs> Oh, that looks much better. Let's paint it as well. Why not? Uh, let's go with red. Very nice. Okay, so how do we get to... The brakes. Oh, there we go. That's how we get to that. Very well. Let's get all those off. And we will be good to go. Although it doesn't seem like it wants to get to the back left tire for whatever reason. Uh. Oh, that's why. It's fine. That's so, like... Why did they do this? I don't understand why they made this. I don't. This is such an odd thing to me. Alright, so I'll buy three of those. And go back into assemble mode. Okay, I didn't want to go there. And of course the other fun thing is, is you always have to push left or right on the D-pad for the game to register to keep going. Because right now if you want to put it back on, no, you have to hit left or right on the D-pad and then it highlights it. Beautiful. And of course this needs to get disassembled. I guess we already... Oh, we already took it off. Okay. With how easy things are, you don't even really pay attention to what you even take off. I mean, there's nothing really requiring any skill. We got a fuel filter, right? Is that what we're looking for? There it is. Dar she blows. Alright. Hitting the wrong buttons. Oh, I forgot you have to get out of that menu, then hit left or right on the D-pad, then you can hit A. Repair completed. Good job. Yay. <laughs> Yay! Only 19,000 for that? Great. Wow. Um. Not gonna lie, pretty disappointed. 
Uh, I'm pretty sure this is just the free to play. Because isn't this on mobile or something? Hang on, let me look at it really quick. Holy crap, it absolutely is. I was right. This is just the free to play. Is it free to play? Yep, it's just the free to play version of the mobile version without the free to play aspect of it. That's why we're getting so much money just from simple fixes on the cars. Don't don't spend $15 on this. Just wait for the Xbox or PlayStation version if you have the other consoles. This is not even worth the time. It really isn't. Uh, menus need work. It's just, it's really not that fun just having everything right there for you. You take it out and that's it. That is not what Car Mechanic Simulator is about. So just, just wait for the Xbox and PlayStation versions. I don't know where they are. You think by now it'd be out by now, but hopefully soon. So thank you guys so much for watching again. Sorry for being a bit more quieter than normal, but like I said, it's almost five o'clock in the morning now. So thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys next time. See ya.